It's not gonna take a photo. It's recording video. Uh, oh, <laughs> move and do things. Ha ha! Yay! <laughs> can we get a photo too, though? Yes, we can. <laughs> Right now, we are looking at some trash cans. These may, in fact, be the only publicly accessible trash cans in all of Taipei. I'd, I mean, just apparently, public trash cans are not a thing in this country. I have no idea what these things are. We just got one in our lunch. They just sort of threw it in the bag, but I'm really digging it. It's like some sort of, some like partially melted jello. Like, mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, a, it's really good. It's like, I really want jello, but I don't have time to chew. It's a part of trade show life. It's totally normal that you end up going all around your main convention center. And like Computex doesn't seem to be any different there. There's like the main show, and then a lot of manufacturers and partners are there. And then other manufacturers, other distributors, they'll set up shop in like a hotel room. And you go to the hotel room, it takes you away from the main show floor. Sometimes that's a bummer, um, but oftentimes you're, when you go to make those appointments, it's because you're really excited about that company or they've got a ton of stuff to show you. Um, and so it's worth it, you know, like I'm, I'm spending the time to leave the main show floor, but I'm gonna go and see something that I, I think is gonna be really cool. And, and I trust that the PR people I've been working with aren't gonna like just waste my time. We're sitting in a hotel lobby now because the opposite happened. Uh, we had a, an appointment for a a name in the technology space that I don't, I mean, they didn't really have anything to show at Computex, but we have a good relationship with them and we wanted to go and see what they were talking about. And uh, we get there and they have these weird sessions set up. So you have to come early and then wait for your appointment time. And then they wouldn't tell us like, what is it that we're here to see? And then we're, we were there for a while before then someone else came up to us and said, oh, by the way, like, uh, we're really excited to have you here. So when you get in there, you can't shoot any video and you can't write any articles and you can't shoot any photos and you can't talk about anything that we're going to show you, but we won't tell you what it is that you're here to see. And I, I okay, so we'll just know what it is, but this, there are other things we could have been covering at Computex. And then we tried to get more information out of them, like, oh, and we can't tell you, but your session will be in a couple hours, so just hang tight. <laughs> That's ridiculous. And so, like, I was so mad. I was so frustrated. Like, instead of sitting here and waiting for the thing you won't tell us about that we're not allowed to talk about, I would much rather go and wait in a hotel lobby for our next appointment and be a couple hours early and do anything else. Like, I was even going to shoot, like, a little vlog there, like, hey, this is the thing, and we're going to cover this stuff here. And instead, I was like, I got to get out of here. This, this is ridiculous. I, I am now, like, as close to actively angry as I can get for my time being wasted like that. And that's the BS game is... Not only do, do I now, I'm pretty confident you did not have something to show a Computex. Now you're trying to purposely waste other tech reporter and YouTubers time so that they won't be able to talk about other things at Computex. And like that's a crappy game to play. So again, we're, we're chilling in a hotel room here. We're about to go see Corsair and uh, Corsair always has crazy cool stuff to show us and they seem to like us. So we'll have a lot of fun there.
So just in stark contrast to where we were with that other company that I'm not gonna mention by name is we just rolled right up here to Corsair and we were a little bit early, but they were super polite about, you know, hey, we were just at maximum occupancy, hold up for just a bit, we'll get you in. You know, one of the higher level executives walked us around their entire product portfolio, everything they were announcing. I got to spend some time just playing with some crazy custom builds. And just like, they seemed happy that we were here. Again, it just makes me feel better about what it is that we're doing when like, you know, the, the PR team that works for a manufacturer, a major manufacturer is just like happy to see us and is excited to show us stuff. I don't know, maybe that's like what Computech should be all about. The freaking thing. So, it was a long day. We were tired. We, we didn't make it out for adventurous food. We were planning on having a whole night out. That, that didn't happen. We got a couple hundred feet. <laughs> we made it, <laughs> made it off the elevator. And there was a restaurant in the lobby. So we just stopped at the restaurant in the lobby. And I had linguini. <laughs> Well, Taiwan is known for its linguine. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was a fun take on what their idea of Western food. Yeah, like global food. Yeah. Okay. I'm not mad. Brian is very, Brian is very upset. He's always mad. He's pissed. He's always mad. He's a pretty, he's an intense dude. That's what it is. <laughs> so, uh, we'll, we'll be more adventurous tomorrow. Yeah, yeah tomorrow yeah. we're gonna do something crazy. I don't know mm -hmm. what it is yet, but it'll be a lot more fun. We might go fishing in a restaurant. And then eat what we catch. That sounds good. Brian's down for that. He seemed not angry about that. Idea. For once. <laughs> for once. Good. Okay. So, See you tomorrow. Guys. See you tomorrow. <laughs>